Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel Spyderill. Today we are going to talk about WhatsApp's view only feature. It's a great way to send photos and videos that vanish after being viewed, keeping your messages super private. But here's the catch. While the view once feature is fantastic for privacy, it can also be misused. Imagine kids sharing inappropriate content, employees leaking sensitive company information or partners hiding messages from each other. Well, stay tuned because we are going to show you how to take a screenshot of these disappearing messages without triggering any notifications. But remember, taking screenshots of anyone's WhatsApp without their consent is illegal and unethical. So it's crucial that you get their permission. Now, let's begin. But before we move on, let me answer this most asked question. Can you screenshot the view once messages? Well, if you're using the latest version of WhatsApp, the developers have implemented screenshot blocking, which means you can't directly take a screenshot of view once messages. But don't worry, we have some clever ways to get around this. Keep watching the video. Using KidsGuard for WhatsApp is the most effective method to save view once messages on the WhatsApp. This professional monitoring tool is designed to automatically take screenshots of view once photos and videos exchanged on WhatsApp. It offers comprehensive monitoring of all WhatsApp activities including chats, call history, voice messages, pictures, videos and more. With KidsGuard for WhatsApp, you can effortlessly monitor your own or another person's WhatsApp account without being detected. To get started, you can download the KidsGuard for WhatsApp from the link provided in the description and comments. It works on both Android and iPhone, allowing you to read all the messages from the target WhatsApp account on your Android or iOS device. The app provides various advanced features such as automatically taking screenshots of view once photos and videos, tracking over 10 types of WhatsApp messages including chats, status updates and call history, recording and listening to WhatsApp calls and exporting all monitored activities to an Excel file for detailed analysis. Overall, using WhatsApp for KidsGuard Pro is the best way to capture screenshots of WhatsApp view once photos and videos. Before we move on to the next methods, it's a request that you subscribe to our YouTube channel for more amazing content. Moving on, you can use your phone's screen recording feature to capture view once WhatsApp messages. Start recording from quick settings, open the message, then stop recording. Later, play the video and take screenshots. Note that WhatsApp will soon block this method, so it may not work for long. Another method to capture a WhatsApp view once screenshot is by using screen mirroring. This involves displaying your phone screen on another device and taking a screenshot from there. To do this, open the screen mirroring app on your phone, which is typically built in on most devices. Then select the device you want to mirror your screen to, such as a computer. Once the screen is mirrored, you can take and save the screenshot from the mirrored device. However, be aware that this method may still trigger a WhatsApp screenshot notification. If you can't take a screenshot directly on your phone, then you can use another device, just like a camera or another phone, to take a picture of the message on your screen. Just open the camera on the other device, aim it at your phone's screen with the message and take a picture. Then you can use the picture as needed. And there you have it, 4 methods to capture WhatsApp view once messages. Whether you are using KidsGuard for WhatsApp, screen recording, screen mirroring or another phone, you can keep those important messages without triggering a notification. Remember to use these methods responsibly and respect others' privacy. If you find this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of our future videos. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.